I'm Ian Poulter and this is what I live for. Coming home, when you walk through the front door, you kick your shoes off, you feel completely relaxed in the environment you're in, you're around friends and family, it's the best feeling in the world. You want me making a cup of tea? There is nothing like an English cup of tea. Not that I don't like an American cup of tea, so I'm not bagging the Americans, I'm just saying that when you make a cup of tea at home, it just tastes different. Proper English tea. No lemon, no honey, English tea. Cheers. I've always loved playing pool, I've always loved playing snooker, and this happens to be the 2004 World Championship final table. This set was the first set of clubs that I used on my European Tour debut, winning the Italian Open in 2000. Uh, feels like yesterday, to be honest. I do work out occasionally. You know, I do have a little bit of a stretching routine that I would do normally before every round of golf. I do have my stretching routine. Leave me alone. You can edit that out. If you were really good, you'd get me to put on that gold lame outfit. But um, it's in a box in the garage, but you, know, you, you can't have that footage. Because A, I don't fit in the outfit, and B, I'm not, I'm not sure I can pull, pull it off today. In there are some proper rascal outfits that really should never see the light of day. Luke! You always seem to be waiting for your kids. Come on, mate. Any time today would work. And we are off to Centurion Golf Club for, for a game of golf. Hopefully today's the day I meet him. I've been very close, but I, we just don't play too often. I think if we played a couple days a week, I would have been done by now. No, if we'd have played twice a week every week, you'd have beat me by now. I reckon. Really? <laughs> yeah. Oh, we'll see that. So, I mean, you playing off levels? Yes, a bit like we always do. Okay, we'll play off levels. So, Toe, it's straight down the middle, though. It's really nice to be home. Um, it's really nice to, you know, to play with Luke and enjoy, you know, nice family time. You can't get enough of it. So when you got the opportunity to take it, then then you definitely want to do that. You're welcome. I've always enjoyed clothing. Like I've always enjoyed trying to dress as as nice as I possibly can. You know, I've worn some, some right rascal outfits through the years, and there are definitely some outfits there that I'm like, really should not have even attempted that, but we live and learn, right? Would well, you want me to shut up so you can hit your shot? Yeah, I did, actually. I worked on the market stall from really 11 till I was 15, so it was like four years of doing, of doing that, which was, uh, which was great fun. I, I loved it. It was a great learning experience, and then transitioning from that into a pro shop to wanting to be the best sales person in the pro shop. So everything I've done in, in, in kind of growing up was always, it was always competition, whether it was golf, whether it was selling the most sets of clubs. And, that, and that's kind of reflective in how I want to play golf. I want to play it to the best of my ability. I want to present myself as well as I possibly can and just enjoy the ride. A bit disorientating to be honest. I felt like I was in a beehive. Oh, you you, you ain't gonna like your lie over there, by the way. You ain't gonna like it. The new Live Golf League is a really cool concept. It's a little different from the norm. 
team format. That's something that I've always loved as a team player, someone that's always thrived on being part of a team. This one up, <laughs> it's really cool. I like the vision behind it. Growing the game of golf, the game is changing, and it's cool to be part of that.